Well, new tonight, authorities say a woman whose body was found in the 70s in Knox County is likely one of dozens of victims killed by Samuel Little. Little may prove to be one of the most prolific serial killers in U.S. history, according to the FBI. He's confessed to killing up to 90 victims across the U.S., including three here in Tennessee. Fox 43 anchor John Becker joining us now with more on this cold case. John. Beth and Brandon, the Knox County Sheriff's Office identified Martha Cunningham as one of the victims Samuel Little described to investigators. Cunningham's body was found in a wooded area in East Knox County in 1975. At the time, her death was thought to be from natural causes. Along with Cunningham, Little says he killed two other women from Tennessee. One woman he met in Chattanooga in either 1980 or 1981 and killed in Dade County, Georgia, just over the state line. Little also says he picked up his third victim in Memphis in 1984, then killed her in West Memphis in Arkansas. Now, the last month has been a difficult one for authorities. Little was indicted for the death of a woman from Texas in 1994. In exchange for his transfer to a Texas County jail, he agreed to reveal the true extent of his crimes. Authorities remain skeptical about his claims, but they have corroborated at least 34 killings tied to that man on your screen. In 2014, he was sentenced to three consecutive life sentences without parole. Brandon and Beth, 